kerja kalian apa? Kalian anak kantoran, anak startup. Ah, nggak main. Anak skena lah. Kerja kok 9 to 5? 1975 lah. Akhir bulan, terima sih gaji. Sleep inside, the eye of your mind lah. Di barbar jaksa terdekat. Akhir bulan, kejar target terus ngedown. Kedak down lah. Beli timah sambil ke Phuket. Di belum punya rumah. Yang penting menang war tiket. Pak, kalau bulan ini, di rapel bulan depannya. Yo, what's up? What's up, people of the world? It's your boy, Juris Kenanda. Today, we gonna talk about Skena culture. Skena came from the word of scenes in English. Literally, scenes can be interpreted as a perkumpulan. While a culture is defined as a budaya in Bahasa. However, the word of Skena in this context uh, is interpreted differently. The context here describes more about life, the lifestyle of teenagers in terms of patients, taste in music, hobbies, and others. For example, in the video that I show you that at the beginning, he discussed how the lifestyle of the Skena culture should be. Start from what the style of clothes should be used and how the work should be done if we apply, apply the scanner cultures in our lives. Uh, people who apply these scanner cultures in their lives are usually called Anna Scanner. Their fashion taste is synonymous with all in one colors. Yes, on only one colors are black and usually anak skena use a band t-shirt sneakers or more specifically use a dog shoe and don't forget about tote bag use tote bag in every bag and usually anak skena also have a small tattoo on his body in every part just like that one and one and everywhere and uh, Anna Skena prefer to work in a creative or freelance field not work in office like going 9 to 5 and like that for example of work they do include me uh, as a painter as a band as a coffee shop barista as a photographer as a videographer and others and the important thing the point is a job that does not require them, them to dress to dress neatly or formally so that even though they they are working they can still express their various style of clothes and they can work everywhere and anytime in that this scan of culture is still for it in to, uh, to is still for it to people in Indonesia, especially among the parents, and also the scanner culture or anak scanner is difficult to describe in terms of its meaning because the word of scanner culture was born just like the among teenagers. So uh, nothing is said about it. Now who we'll start? It started and when this Kena culture exists and the addition to the role of the Anaskena in the Kena culture there are also another role there, there is also in, have another role namely is policy scheme I think this one that is not important to we talk about it I think it's very interesting and it's fun to 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 discuss about it. Okay, then the policy scanner are a handful of people who judge the style of the application of this scanner culture in in their life. For example, Andre. Andre is a teenager wearing a Metallica band T-shirt. Then Andre goes out. To the hangout, to hang out with at the coffee shop with his friends, and suddenly Brian comes to Andre and asks to Andre about 
mention this Unread mention three song from Metallica. So if Andre can answer, Andre will be labeled as a poster. Poster is a someone who just join in without knowing what he is doing or when. So this Brian can be called a policy scanner. Okay, I think that's all for me. Thanks for your input. I think that's all. Thanks for your attention. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh.